Hi hey everyone, it's Phil. I'm here to introduce you to a beautiful espresso coffee, Las Margaritas. Uh, the country of origin is Colombia, and it comes from the Valle de Cauca region. Very well known for some very beautiful coffees. Las Margaritas is produced by the group La Esperanza. They own several very high quality farms around Colombia and they're committed to producing some of the best coffees possible. We're very excited about this coffee. We've worked with La Esperanza coffees before, so we're more than excited to be able to get our hands on this lot again. Um, it's delicious every time we get it. Uh, what's interesting about this farm is they're really aligned with their passion for the planet. Around 20% of the farm is devoted to animal and forest reserve. Uh, they use such processing methods as dry fermentation to really try and limit the water waste coming from this farm. But what you can expect to taste in this coffee is a very complex mix of fruits, including apricot, blueberry, green grape, black tea and jasmine. Yum! So this coffee is a washed processed coffee, but it's done with a dry fermentation period of under 22 hours. It's fermented in coffee cherry skin. Then that coffee cherry skin is removed before dried on patios. This adds intensity to flavor. It really brings out a delicious creamy mouthfeel. The variety of this coffee is geisha. Uh, we really love our geisha coffees, which is apparent with the amount on this coffee program at the moment. And Colombia, we find, produce amazing geisha coffees. To get the best out of this coffee, we, we found while using a 20 gram basket that dosing slightly under a 19 and a half really helps out with the balance of the coffee. We're using a little bit hotter 95 degrees and the extraction is around 45 gram extraction weight. This is subject to change as it is a natural product. So if you wanna see any updated brew guides, please check the, the link below. Once brewed, what we do love to do is add around 10 to 15 mils of hot water. It really balances out those flavors. The intensity makes a beautiful, clean espresso. We hope you enjoy this last margarita espresso as much as we do. If you have any recipe ideas or something you find works with the coffee, we'd love to hear it. Please share in the comments. 